Hey drone technology fans, Bill here. DJI Mavic 2 Waypoints 2.0 Precision Landing Test coming up next. Last week I had the opportunity to be able to test the DJI Mavic 2 Waypoints 2.0 for the first time. One of the big issues that came up for me was precision landing. As you saw in the, vi in the video, if you want to check it out, I'll throw a card up there, is my precision landing was off by at least two to three feet and I had to take manual control of landing. So what I thought I would do was to move the landing pad out quite a ways from where it was before, more out in the open, and rerun the test. So what I did was I did two tests, back to back, precision landing. Let's go ahead and roll that clip. We are going to go ahead and test DJI Mavic 2 Waypoints 2.0 precision landing. As many of you are aware, my precision landing was considerably off. There's one, two, three, four, and then it's going to be returned to home after that. Screen recorder is on. I verified that. Hit go. Cruising speed at 17.9 miles per hour. Hit start. And we're going to slide to takeoff. And the onboard camera is on right now. And we should get up to about 163 feet here. And then it'll head to waypoint one. We're at 97% battery. We're at 163 feet. We are now heading to waypoint one. Seventeen point eight miles an hour, one hundred and sixty two feet, looking good. Course holding steady. Okay, approaching waypoint one as we speak. And we're at waypoint one, and it slows down and makes a turn towards waypoint two. We're on our way to waypoint two, and it's doing a arc as it hits, goes to waypoint two. Camera seems steady. We just hit waypoint two, and now we're on our way to waypoint three. Still 163 feet, 17.9 miles per hour. Holding on to the course looks good. Just hitting waypoint three right now. And it's on its way to waypoint four. Holding the course, looking good. And we just hit waypoint four. We should be getting returned to home any second now. Go home. We are returning home right now. The speed increases to about 25 miles per hour, still at 164 feet. Should be hearing it any second now. And there she is. And we're going to adjust the pitch of the gimbal down so we can see precision landing here. Okay, it is overhead as we speak. Landing. And it's lining itself up right now, locating landing point. Looking on target here, looking good.
85% battery, plenty left here. Looking like we're gonna have a successful landing here. It looks to be on target. And we're landing right on target here, folks. All right, precision landing was absolutely fantastic there, absolutely spot on. We're gonna go ahead and do a second test here, so let's get this back up in the air. Screen recorder is still on. We are still, camera is still on. Let's go ahead and open up waypoints again. Setting four waypoints at about the same location. Hit go. Speed at 17.9 miles per hour. Start. Slide to takeoff. Take off. And the camera's already engaged, so we're good there. Batteries at 83%. feet, 163 feet right now, we're on our way to waypoint one. Everything looking good. Seventeen point nine miles per hour, one hundred sixty-three feet, approaching waypoint one right now, and it's there. It is slowing down, and it's heading to waypoint two right now. And approaching waypoint two, 164 feet, and it's slowing down, 79% battery. On our way to waypoint three. As you can see outside, it is a beautiful day here. It is in the mid 70s, could not ask for better weather. Approaching waypoint three right now. And we are there. Now we're heading the final waypoint, waypoint four. 77% battery. Heading to waypoint four. Approaching waypoint four right now. Now we are heading return to home. Let's take a look here and see if we get precision landing to work on shot number two here. Looked very good the first time. So on course, 27 miles an hour, 165 feet, 74% battery. When we get over the house, I'll adjust the pitch of the gimbal. So we can take a look for precision landing. And there she is. Adjusting the pitch of the gimbal. It is now over the house. It is getting ready to position itself for landing. And locating landing point, on target, looking good. 100 feet. We're up on 50. Looking like we're gonna be on target again here. This is fantastic. Looking like it's going to be a spot-on landing here, very close to it. And the 
Mavic 2 is coming right down on the pad. So this precision landing test was a success. We did it twice, pretty much the same route as waypoints, and it landed right on the pad. So that was a successful test of waypoints 2.0 precision landing. Okay, you can see the precision landing worked perfectly both times. So my uh, theory was right in that it was just in too tight of an area and I believe that obstacle avoidance and the sensors just didn't like where the area was. So I had to take over and manually land it. So I was very pleased with that. Question of the day, have you had any issues with precision landing with your DJI Mavic 2 with Waypoints 2.0? Let me know in the comments section below. If you like the content from today's video, please make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and tell others about the channel. Also, be sure to check out my Facebook page where I do post daily updates regarding the drone and drone industry and anything DJI, Autel, or Parrot related. Also, be sure to check out my Twitter account where I do post daily updates and Instagram as well. Thanks so much for watching and remember, it's a great day to fly.